Shifting one's focus from getting to giving is not only a nice way to live life, but a financially profitable way as well. Now, some people might ask, but isn't that kind of naive? Isn't it naive? Isn't it a bit unrealistic to believe that in today's day of self-absorption, corporate scandals, and dog-eat-dog -dog competition, that one can actually give their way to success? So ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to ask you to join us in welcoming Bob Burr. to be able to deal with people in a way that's constructive, in a way that's helpful. He is the focus. You can't be focused on the money. You must be focused on bringing value because that's what turns into money. When you combine excellence and consistency, you create truly great value. It's never about the numbers. The numbers are a result of caring about the people. When you sell on price, you're a commodity. When you sell on value, you're a resource. Every time you have a referral, what you've basically done is created the opportunity for more customers, more referrals, and more business building. See, many people, they, they have, there's sort of a misnomer about selling. People think selling is about trying to convince someone to buy something they don't want or need. That is not selling. That's called being a thief, okay? <laughs> I define selling simply as discovering what the other person needs, wants, or desires, and helping them to get it. When you're selling, you're giving. How can I say that? What are you giving them? I suggest you're giving them time, attention, counsel, education, empathy, and most of all, value. You know, it's often been said that success in business, success in life is based about 10% on technical skills and 90% on people skills. The single greatest people skill is a well-developed and authentic interest in the other person. All the great leaders, the greatest leaders, the top influencers, the highest producers in the business, right? The highest money earners, that's simply how they run their lives and conduct their businesses. They're always looking for ways to place other people's interests even before their own, finding ways to add value to their lives. Each of us in our lives has a natural sphere of influence of about 250 people. The golden rule of business, of sales, of networking, is that all things being equal, people will do business with and refer business to those people they know, like, and trust. And there's no, no faster, more powerful, or more effective way to elicit those feelings toward you from others than by, again, looking for ways to make their life better. When you can move from an I focus or a me focus to an other focus, looking for ways to bring value to others, people feel good about you. And this is why we say that money is simply an echo of value. Money is an echo of value. It's the thunder to values lightning. The value comes first and the money is simply a direct and very natural result of the value you've provided. Now, when I say the word networking, and I, I speak all over the world on this topic, and it doesn't matter the language, it doesn't matter the country, it doesn't matter the culture, when you say the word networking, people get this picture in their mind 
of the stereotypical networking sales guy, right? You know, the guy who kind of works the crowd. You know, they backhand, slap hand, shake hand, slap, right? Stick a business card aggressively into the person's face and say, hey, give me a call, cut you a deal. <laughs> or if you or somebody you know needs a witchamahoozy, feel free to call anytime, any place, any way, any day, anyhow. <laughs> then there's the old wink and a nod. Let's do lunch. <laughs> and that is not networking. What that is, is, actually I'm not sure what that is, but it, it, trust me, it's not networking. Not networking. Networking is the cultivating of mutually beneficial give and take or give and receive win-win relationships. When done correctly, when done with a genuine caring about the other person, about their wants, their needs, their desires, now you're putting yourself in the position where you can really create some powerful referral-based relationships. So when people meet you and you handle yourself just so well and so confidently but humbly and you ask about themselves and you listen and then you follow up with such a nice quick note the next day, that's a professional. And again, we make this connection, we make these connections, we do these things not because we're going to get something from it. No, we give value to others because we like to give value to others. Embrace that just like breathing out and breathing in, giving and receiving are simply two sides of the very same coin, and they work in tandem. And so long as your focus is on the giving, of giving of value to everyone you meet, so long as your focus is on the giving and you, and you allow the receiving you will receive in and you will live in abundance. An abundance of joy, an abundance of friendship, an abundance of love, an abundance of kindness, an abundance of money, an abundance of referrals, an abundance of new people in your organization and new customers. And often they'll come from right in front of your eyes. And other times they'll come from way out of left field seemingly out of nowhere, but in reality, out of everywhere. Thank you so very much.